on your home page in mail softly you have your um, on the left si sidebar you have your contacts so let's click on contacts here under contacts you can as you see you have a filter here you can search for contacts by their name and also on the uh, on, on this button there's a button here as you see and you can from here you can just have kind of uh, more advanced fields so first name last name job title and you know if let's say that first name includes like ALK let's say and apply filters so it's gonna go through all the contacts with uh, their first name in group uh, ALK, for instance. Or you can again, you know, add more filter and also last name in group EA, let's say. It will just create, you know, the other ones too. So, so th these are the filters, and uh, let's say that you also can filter by contact tag. And let's say that um, I have a Burlingame Small Business Expo um, contact, so apply filters. So it's gonna just bring all the contacts with this contact tag. And as you see here, you know, you'll be able to see the contact tag there. So that's why it's important. While importing your contacts, you can include some tags and later you can just use those tags in your contacts index page and you can just filter them out and you can create new contact list for you. So here as you see <coughs> you can see create list 68 from 68 contacts. If I click on it it will automatically create the list of all the results you're seeing here. Or what you can do you can just select here to any contacts select it create list at the contract list an existing one or you can assign a different tag for that and here if you if you want to just switch the page you can just show the results for you know like 50 or 100 so that you can just you know select all 100 or 68 from, from here too so um create list means that you can you are creating a new list from this contact Add to contact list means that you're selecting a kind of an existing contact list and you will be able to just add those contacts to your existing contact list. And um, a sign tag is actually you're just assigning a, a tag for the specific users, uh, contact, sorry, for that. So this is how you uh, just play around in the contact index page, how you, you know, play around with, with, with your uh, contacts and filtering and segmentation also I want to show you that your um, contacts index page is also customizable as you see here whichever information you have available in your contacts you just you know, wanted to show them for instance if you want okay just show me also the um, I don't know like um, send mails kind of thing okay so let's say that, so let's clear this, let's come here, I don't know if you already know, yeah, okay, so edit columns, send, send, also include send mails, and websites, maybe, um, right, so um, when, when I click apply, so it will automatically actually bring the uh, send mail and website to it, you see here, okay, so, but I want to just change it right now, I don't want it to appear, so why okay, just come back. so this is this is the one place that you can play around with your contacts or what you can do is you can come to your contact lists and again on the left side and inside and here are the contact lists so these are the lists these are the audiences okay so you can create you know indefinite in infinite number of uh, contact lists so um but there's another uh, different uh, kind of a UI I want to show you. So when you click on create a contact list up here, so let's say that mail softly contact list for Burlingame um, trade show, something like that.
So, <clears throat> so as you see here, set your list name, filter and add phone text, and we will list and save. So, um, let's click on next. So here again, you you have all your you know contacts here. As you see right now in our demo account, we have two thousand four total contacts. So what you can do is again, it's very similar to the contacts index page, but I just wanted to show you you know there's also this possibility that you can just come here and you can just uh, you know use this uh, field too. So here, <coughs> what you have, what you can have is again, uh, let's say that uh, I will filter by contact tag which was Berlin game small business expo 2020 Berlin game apply filters so here as you see we have 69 results so if I want to add all of them to here so that's name of the conduct is for building and trade list right now we have we haven't added anything so what we can do is we can just come and Let's say that just add this too, add select it. That will come here, okay? Or you know you wanna just add 20, add select it, 20 will go that side. So you have a you have control of which contacts you wanna add, on, uh, or you know you can just add all of them. Let's say that we just wanted to add these guys and click on next. Here we have 22 contacts. And if everything seems good, you can save here. Save list. There we go. So we have 22 contacts, as you see here, with uh, with their um, kind of tags here. And right now, I can just compose an email for them, or I can just send an email by using you know our newsletter or email editor, and so on and so forth. So that's that's how you do the uh, your um, filtering and also how to use your um, tags here. So here, what you can do is with with this contact list, you can merge with another list. This contact list, okay? So for instance, you wanna you wanna just merge with these guys. You can merge this contact list, okay? And you can also have two options merge contact into this list or merge contacts and create a new list so you can just build your new list by just combining some other contact lists together but instead of just you know replacing the existing contact lists you can create a new one so that's just pretty you know like a practical way of just playing around so again you can add contacts you can choose from contacts again you can go to this big you know like again filtering kind of thing and you can play around with your contact list. Or what you can do is you can split your contact list into groups. Okay? So let's say that you know you have 10,000 contact lists and you want to split into like five lists. Okay? So what it ends up being is actually it just divides your 10,000 uh, contact lists into five. So like 2,000 each approximately. And it will just, you know, like make sure that you just um, uh, just create a smaller sub list of those contacts why you need that because maybe you don't want to just send 10,000 emails at once but rather you want to just uh, in terms of deliverability and in terms of you know, not overloading your system so you can just uh, you just you may just want to need that so let's say let's put it into two contacts let's see what's going to happen what's going to do so apply as you see here, we have split your contact into two pieces. It's already, you know, split it into, you know, just 11 to 11. So show contact list, show, show contact lists here. So as you see, main soft contact list so for Berlin Game Trade Show, piece one. And main soft contact list Berlin Game Trade Show, piece two. As you see, right now you have two uh, different uh, contact lists but let's see so here we have the full list and here we have the you know piece one and piece two ones. so the the first one is also preserved and it's also divided into these two uh, equal pieces together so um 
that's how you uh, play around with, 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 your, with your contract lists. So I also want to mention this text section. So tags are important because that's how you segment, how can you segment, how, can, how you can segment your contacts. So you can create tag up here, you know, any tag, let's say that, you know, like, uh, we, we, we can say that, um, Berlin game, trade show contacts, let's say. Okay, you can choose a kind of a, you know, color. So what will you use this tag for if it is a contact or contact list? You can also use contact contact lists too. I mean, the tags are also for contact lists too. But generally speaking, we do the uh, for the contact lists. So create tag. So right now, you know, we just created a tag for Berlin game trade shows, but there's no uh, contacts in there. So let's go and just um, tag these ones. Again, in here we can come here and we can say that okay, so it was Burning Game Small Business Expo 2001 is a Burning Game um, contact. So here we have you know 68. So as you see here, add text 68. So let's come and uh, search for Burning Game trade show contacts as we just you know just created this here and let's hit say. So what, what it will do is actually it will just create a, you know tags for that. I mean it will just tag for each one of them here and you know you, you will be able to see uh, all of them uh, in, in this uh, list, in this tag. So or you know you can come and you can just assign tags specifically, you know rolling in trade show contacts again, you know you can hit save. As you see, it just added. So let's let's go for this contact, for instance. Here, as you see, it's Berlin game uh, notation contact. Just add it here. So <clears throat> that's pretty much what it, what it is today. So thank you very much.